you guys are still going on, Super Cat for here. Uh, video two of the rebuild. Um, it is raining outside like crazy, so I can't really do much to the car. So I figured I'd take today to just do a crap load more deadening. Uh, probably gonna hit my doors with an entire another layer, and that's about it. Um, that's all I really need to do. I need to do my doors, I need to do my roof, but I'm not going to do my roof until I'm done with the wall because that's pointless. There's going to be 2x4s and expanding foam on top of the wall holding the roof down, so I'm not going to, there's going to be probably, I don't know, like 9 square feet of roof space, if that, maybe like 7 square feet of roof space that I actually have to sound deaden once I get done, so a uh, couple things I've been thinking about. I haven't decided whether I'm gonna use a stripper pole or not. Um, I don't know if I need one. I mean, it's only 415s. I'm not sure yet. Uh, yeah, I guess that's about it. A uh, couple people asked me to explain to them. I told them I'd do it in a video. I had a couple uh, PMs this morning saying what made you change your mind basically um obviously i think they're talking about uh going from a flat box with 415s to the wall um there's two main people that made me change my mind one is seeing neil barber's s10 blazer this dude is crazy 20, uh, 12 15s uh he had 24 10s at one point awesome it and it's a clam so, hell yeah. Um, another person, A21 Bravo. 815s and a Chrysler 300, I believe. Either a Dodge Magnum or a Chrysler 300. I'm pretty sure it's a 300. So, dude, 815s and a Diamond, that's crazy. Um, so, yeah, basically those two people uh, and their cars, let alone, just completely changed my mind about doing a flat box, and that's why I want to do the wall. So... I'm gonna get to some deadening since it's raining. So, well, first I have to find my hand roller, and then I'm gonna get to some deadening. Later. All right, guys. One thing I've learned with working with sound deadener, you always get cut. Yeah. Whatever. All right, guys. Uh, got a lot of sound deadening done today. Did two more layers on each door. Still have a crap load left. But, uh, alas, it did not stop raining, so. Truck goes into the shop tomorrow to hopefully, here, let me show you this real quick. Uh, uh, get that oil leak fixed. I have a box sitting underneath my truck because of all the frickin' oil. So, hopefully I get that oil leak fixed and my windshield leak fixed. So, yeah, that'll be tomorrow. I Probably won't get the truck back till about Wednesday. So, yeah. But, yep, this is rebuild video number two. Yeah. Oh, I bought my I bought a seven-inch touchscreen monitor. Well, not touchscreen, but button. Seven-inch monitor with buttons. And a LED backup camera, six LED. So, that'll be here, I don't know, I think it's going to take like a week and a half, which sucks, but yeah, that'll be there, that'll be here, I think on the 15th, that's uh, like a week or so, but uh, yeah, I'll make a video as soon as possible, later.